to my channel. I am Tori Lynn. Let's blossom today. Hello guys, it is Christmas Eve. I hope you guys have had an amazing holiday season and you're having a good Christmas Eve. Tomorrow is the big day and I am super excited so I thought I would bring you guys this fun holiday look. It's got a super simple nude upper lid and then we smoke it out with some fun red and add a beautiful Christmas red lip. If you guys are interested in how I got here and what I use, just keep watching. Also, you guys can follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I will have both of those links down in the description box below. And also hit the subscribe button before this video starts. Merry Christmas Eve, you guys. Let's jump into this. So, okay. What are we doing here? So I want to start off by doing my foundation today. I have already prepped and primed and gotten my skin ready. But for foundation, I'm going to be using the Revlon Color Stay. I finally picked another one of these up. This is one of my absolute favorites. I've been using this foundation for ever, it feels like. Um, I get the shade 110 in the winter, and then usually I get like 210 in the summertime. But um, so this foundation is amazing. If you guys have not tried it, you should get it. I'm just going to take my beauty sponge here. This is a ColourPop beauty sponge. And I'm just gonna take some on the flat end and work it around my skin. Next, I'm gonna take my concealer. This is the Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Porcelain Beige. Next, I'm going to bake using my Cody Translucent Airspun Powder. Next, I'm going to stop here and go ahead and throw on my brows. Moving into the eyes, I'm going to be using my Huda Beauty Rose Gold Palette today. I'm going to start by taking the color called Bay. It's this really creamy vanilla -y shade and I'm going to set my lid from the lashes all the way up to my brow bone. Next, I'm going to be mixing two shades. I'm going to be mixing this shade here called Suede and this shade here called Sandalwood. I feel like Suede is going to be too dark and Sandalwood is a little too warm for what I want. So I'm just going to mix those two and I'm going to work them into my crease. This eye look is going to be extremely simple. Uh, we're going really simple on the top and then we're just going to add a pop of color at the lower lash line. It's really it. It's kind of a nude look here. And I'm just going to make sure to really smoke out this shade. Next, I'm going to take this shade called Moon Dust, which is a light gold shimmery shade, and I'm just going to use my finger, and I'm going to pack that onto the lid. There is a fly. I don't know if you guys can see it flying around. There's a fly that has been living in my house for about a week now. 
My husband named him, so he's never gonna go away, and I'm about ready to lose it. Everywhere I go, he follows. If I'm watching TV, he's sitting on the TV or trying to land on me. If I'm in here filming, he's in here flying around me, and I'm about ready to lose it. While we're still on the eyes, I'm gonna go ahead and take my NYX Epic Ink Liner in the shade Black and draw a nice, thick line on there. I might wing it out, we'll see how I feel. So I did decide to wing it out by the way, so I'm just gonna go ahead and toss on a wing on the other side. Let's stop with the eyes. We're gonna go back into the skin. I'm gonna go ahead and set everything using again my Cody Translucent Air Spun Powder. a little warmth back in my skin. I'm going to be using my Hoola bronzer from Benefit. I'm going to go in and do my highlight next. I'm going to be using the Disney Designer Collection from ColourPop in the shade Horse and Carriage. Next, I'm gonna grab my favorite blush. This is the Laura Geller Baked Blush in the shade Tropic Hues. I just love this blush. I feel like it just melts everything together so beautifully and it adds just a little bit of warmth without getting too rosy. And then I'm going to add a little on my nose and while we're thinking about the nose, I forgot to contour. So let's go ahead and quickly contour my nose using the same bronzer that I used just a minute ago. Now that our skin is done, I want to go ahead and head back up into the eyes. I want to smoke out that bottom lash line with a pop of color. Sticking with the same palette, I'm going to use this really bright red shade called Man Eater. And I'm gonna work that shade all the way into the inner corner. Now that palette doesn't really have a, an inner corner highlight that I really like, so I'm gonna go back to one of my absolute faves. This is the Unique Cosmetics Single Shadow in the shade uh, Gentle. So I'm going to go ahead and pop that on my inner corner and I'll probably pop it on the brow bone as well. Now that I have all my powder products on and ready to be set, I'm going to take my ColourPop Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Acid Setting Mist. And then I'm gonna go ahead and toss on my lashes using my IT Cosmetics Superhero Mascara. I feel like this look needs a pretty red lip to tie it all together. 
So I'm going to be using one of my favorite red lip combos. This is the Jante Blue Lip Liner in the shade Brown Sugar. And I'm going to top it off with this Elf, Elf, with this Elf Lippy in the shade Brett. Now that I have my lip liner done, I'm going to go ahead and add the Brett over top. All right, and this completes the look. I really love this lip combo, the combination of the dark kind of brown red lip liner with the bright glossy red over top just makes like the perfect holiday red and I really like how it all ties together with the red smoke under eye smoke um if you guys like this video please give this video a thumbs up if you want to see what other cool videos and makeup looks I have created hit that subscribe button down below thank you guys so much for watching I will see you guys next time I hope you had an amazing holiday season love you guys goodbye